Hey everybody, Jimmy Leslie here, Guitar Player Magazine Frets Editor, taking a look at the Breedlove Legacy Concertina E today. This is Breedlove's newest body style, the Concertina. It's a small body, parlor style guitar with 12 frets to the body. Their design goal here being to get a big sound out of this small instrument, and we're going to check it out and see how it is. All right, let's take a look at this beautiful body. And if you can tell, I mean, this is small. I'm not a very big dude. And this fits beautifully, like a little baby here in my arms. And it's made out of the legacy wood combination for the concertina body style. It means that it has a solid Sitka spruce top. And it's a salvaged top, meaning that no tree was specifically felled to make this guitar, because these guys in Bend, Oregon, up there at Breedlove, they care about the environment. So I'm going to flip it around to the back, and wow, you should see it out in the sunshine too. This is beautiful. Cocobolo wood. It's a dense hardwood that they've cut down nice and thin to make this guitar with the goal of being a big sound coming from the small body. Let's uh, take a look at some of the other woods they've used. This is an African ebony for this Delta style bridge right here. And cruising up towards the sound hole, you can see that it's surrounded by a legacy knot. Beautiful rosette there. Inside, tucked away, are the electronics. Otherwise, you wouldn't notice them probably if I didn't point it out. But that's the LR Bags Anthem True Mic system, meaning that there is a microphone and a piezo pickup right in here that you can blend to get the combination of sound you want when you amplify the, the guitar. Moving along to the uh, the neck that's made out of Honduran mahogany. It's got an ebony fretboard on it. And cruising up towards the headstock, look at that. It's a beautiful slotted headstock with open gear tuners. Those are Goto 700 tuners right there. <laughs> Okay, so one thing I noticed right away is the sustain on this baby. I'm just going to strum a chord and let it ring out. Listen to this. You can really feel it vibrating up against your body. This thing is practically alive. Um, now I'll, I'll play a few single note runs so you can kind of get what each string sounds like. Guitar is uh, screams out to be finger picked doesn't mean you can't play it with a pick that's for sure. I'm gonna hit some big chords here and you see how it sounds. You'll notice there's a lot of low end coming out of this. <laughs> I 
notice the string spacing here gives me plenty of room to get to get around on it and I use a little finger picking technique a kind of a slap technique that I think that's going to work really well on this guitar <laughs> First thing that struck me about this guitar when I played it acoustically was just how much low end girth was coming out of this small instrument. And then the same thing when I plug it in for the first time and give it a big strum. This system captures the full body of the guitar in, in, in a beautiful way, a beautiful bold way. Okay, so I've got my balance set on my LR Bags Anthem system here, and it is plugged into this an AER Compact 6030 Tommy Emanuel Signature Amplifier. I've got all the knobs essentially straight up at, at noon so that the amp is not coloring the sound of the guitar very much. This is the true sound. <laughs> Alright, so it's been a lot of fun taking a good look and a listen to this Breedlove Legacy Concertina and the thing that really just jumps out at you, big sound from a small body. It's really beautiful and it sounds great plugged in, it's a versatile instrument, finger picking, very very easy to play, very articulate and the kind of instrument that an aficionado is going to appreciate. Hope you appreciated this look and listen today. Mm -hmm.